Well, some dogs have a tendency to get a little into a little mischief, but this morning two pups took that to the next level. You're just going to wonder how they ended up doing this. Somehow they dialed 911, not once, not twice, but 16 times. Fox 9's Sarah Danik is live in Lakeville tonight. And Sarah, you met the two uh, dogs that were behind all of this, so what gives? Yeah, yeah, I did it. Hey, for being so bad, they are so cute. Yeah, little Remy and Bomber were left alone at their home in Lakeville today uh, while their owner had to go to work. But little did anyone know the amount of ruckus they would get into today. Have a seat. Don't let these furry faces fool you. These two might just be the baddest boys in the neighborhood. The Papillon and the Hound are the newest partners in crime. 911, what's the address of emergency? So we were dispatched together to a 911 hang up call at a residence in Lakeville. These are officers Michelle Roberts and Emily Bears. They've checked out their share of 911 hang up calls, but not like this. It was just kind of weird. Usually people come to the door or seeing two dogs just go hyper. It's not something I see all the time. They rang the doorbell, walked around the house, and were about to clear the call. Shortly after clearing, uh, dispatch advised us they had multiple additional 911 calls and all they could hear in the background was dogs barking. Hello? Hello, 911? And those 911 hang-up calls continued 16 times. The only suspects were these doggone residents. Officer Roberts was able to get a hold of the owner and got in the home through the garage. I did check to see if they did want to go outside, if that was their reason for calling. They, they weren't interested. They more were interested in, in being pet at that point. Um, but went upstairs to uh, his office where the cell phone was, and it, it was on the desk. It was on emergency call only. So in theory, a dog could have dialed 911. It would just have to push push the screen with its its paw. Remy and Bomber had apparently taken matters into their own paws. So our assumption is the dogs were having a rough day and it was the <laughs> dogs that were seeking assistance through 911. So what turns the best boys bad? We wanted to know ourselves. So we asked, Remy, we have some questions here at Fox 9 for you. Did you have a rough day? Maybe we'll never know the reason and maybe we don't need to. Anytime we can we can laugh and Talk about dogs calling 911. <laughs> it's uh, if that's the biggest news of our day, that's a good day. Yeah. Yeah, you can see they didn't want to answer our question, so I guess guilty as charged there. Now the owner tells me that he was just stunned that this all happened. He says he had no idea his dogs could make any kind of calls, let alone to 911. And he said, lesson learned, he will be putting his phone away from now on. We are live in Lakeville, Sarah Danik, Fox 9.